Hey guys, if you want to learn how to recreate this makeup whilst I'm taking it off, <laughs> please keep watching and at the end there will be pictures I'm hoping. Um, if you've enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. All links will be in the description. Hope you enjoy and have fun and express your inner self. See you soon. <clears throat> Today, as you can see, I have red eyes. I've put contacts in, so it's a contact day, okay? So if you've got red contacts, put them in, or if you've got green ones, go with that, okay? This is gonna be a, I'm gonna say a dramatic look, okay? So basically, I'm gonna go with the purples of this palette. I might mix in a tiny bit of red and black just to really heavy it out, you know? So let's get started, okay? So I'm going to start off with a eye primer. And it's going to be this one. Actually, I'm just going to do both eyes because I can cut most of this out. Right. So apply your eyeshadow primer. Your eye primer, sorry, not your eyeshadow. Now I'm going to start applying like your main shades, I'm going to apply the lid shade and then I'm going to apply a dark shade to smoke it all in and blend it. I just want to blow this look out, okay? So I'm going to take an E103 brush from Revolution and I'm going to take the darkest purple I can find in the palette, which is this one here. This is, by the way, the Jazzuli palette. I spoke about it in my cheap products, I think. and just really heavily pack that on the eye, okay? Now you don't have to worry about the whole highlight in the eye bit because this is gonna be like a demon kind of inspired look. Now, I'm not a proper person, I'm not a proper person. Then I'm gonna grab on a different E103 brush from makeup. I'm gonna grab a black shade and I'm just gonna deepen up the crease here. Just to really help blow it up. And then mix in that purple shade as well to help blend that black out. And then, on a fluffy brush, grab a kind of um, a yellowy off-white colour, like this one, okay? And this is just going to help blend this edge here. And then go in with that purple and black mix on the brush, okay? And now I'm going to go on to do an eyebrow. Now I'm going to do a black eyebrow because why not? Let me find an eyebrow brush. Hold on, I just lost it again. There it is. So I'm going to take an E104, which is an angled liner brush, if you can see that, okay? This is from Makeup Revolution. And I'm going to take a black shade from that Jazuli palette. And I'm just going to run that through the eyebrow. A spoolie brush. <clears throat> and I'm going to... Try and brush that and help diffuse a little bit of the brown so it kind of evens out all the way through. Now I'm going to grab a liquid liner, okay? And we're going to move on to the eyes, uh, the liner. And I'm going to take an artish brush. Uh, this is just a number one rainy rang, whatever you want to call it.
like that. I'm just going to go on to do a mascara. And for that, we're going to just use two cheap ones. Uh, this is a voluming and a lengthening one. I'm going to start with the volumizing one, okay? And then on to the lengthening one, okay? <clears throat> and if you have the 3D fiber one, just use that one. Little tip there. Okay. Bear with me. Okay, so now I'm going to go and do the other eye on my face off uh, camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm going to take my uh, Avon Super Shock Jet Eyeliner Pencil in black and I'm just going to line my waterline. Right. Then you're going to take to start with a angled E104 brush like that okay and you're gonna take a black shadow okay because this is what's gonna help pull the look together So yeah, when it comes to doing these types of looks, people like to do white on the waterline. I'm like, you need to start. This is meant to be demon -y, okay? It's meant to be heavy and drag. So now I'm going to take a bit of purple on the E103 brush. Just to help blow it out a bit. Okay. So now I'm going to do an angled, I'm going to do some contour and I'm going to take the Pro Stray palette from Freedom and I'm just going to lightly mix the three, I want it heavy and I'm just going to place main product here, okay. And then I'm going to go on to do it, let me just I'm going to go on to doing lips. Now, I'm not sure what lip to do with this. I'm thinking red. Yeah, we're doing red, a dark red. So I'm going to start off with a black line. Right. So grab a black pencil and just line your lips to the way you would do them. So yeah, I'm going to take the Pro Lipstick Intense Noir from Freedom and it's just a dark kind of purpley wine colour. Like that. Okay. Now it's quite heavy gothic demon -y, but this is what we were aiming for, what I was aiming for anyway. Now I'm going to take um, a fluffy brush. And I'm going to take the Stripe Palette from Freedom and I'm going to use the highlight shade, okay? The, the highlighter, yeah. Just lightly here. Oh, lashes, I forgot lashes. So we're going to take the Eyelore 107 lashes with the Eyelore glue. And then I'm going to just apply them and put them into place. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so now I'm gonna go and apply a wig and tidy up, and then I'll be right back with you with the end result and look and a closing thing. How I will act. Okay, you so that's me with the wig on. I didn't put earrings in because I'm just yeah no. Uh, I hope you've liked this look. I'm not sure the wig goes with it. I think it doesn't look very demonic, to be honest. And I will switch it up with the other one I've got right here. Um, if you like it, give me a thumbs up. And if you want more looks like this, I'm hoping to get into using like latex products, silicone, stuff like that this year. Um, if you want to see any of that, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. And uh, yeah, see you for future videos.